Hey there, everyone. Welcome back to another day of No Man's Sky. We are still in the process of building our base. So I actually just noticed there's no door here. I'm still... I'm still in the elements when I go in. So hold on, hold on, hold on. What? No, it's there. What's with what's with it? Wait, 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 hold on, hold on. Does it do something? Why won't the door shut? What is going on with this door? It's got power. Okay, 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 okay. So let's go to tech. And then and we need some storage as well. Magnetized ferrite and sodium. Can I put this inside though? I can put this inside. Do I want to put that inside? I don't know. I have no idea anymore. Um, so we got portable, general, power. I want some batteries. So I need condensed carbon and magnetized ferrite. Okay. Okay. And I did actually, and we're going to put it inside. I did actually pick up my portable refiner. Right there. Uh, because it get bugging out So let's go ahead and put that down Yep, we're just gonna put it inside here BAM and I'll, hmm. I Was gonna say I wonder if I could actually pick it or if I could Ooh, I, did I really lose all my condensed carbon I had in it? That's kind of lame And then give me I have yeah the pure ferrite What does that turn into? Living slime, gross. Cut back in. Um, and then we're going to do pure ferrite because I need the magnetized ferrite. That's going to give us damn only ninety-one. And how many do I need? How many do I need for a battery? I need sixty, so I can have one battery. Cool. Now we need. Hey, hey, get off my lawn! What are you guys doing here? You act like you're pooping. Get! Get! Yeah! Go, you turkeys. Um, this door's bothering me. I might have to Google that. Unless, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. It needs power. I'm a dumb dumb. It needs power. Hold on, hold on. Let's get rid of that. That's hideous. Um, left control. Delete. Delete that. Okay. Ah, oh, I'm so stupid. Nope. Really? Let me in. <laughs> I locked myself out. <laughs> oh, God. Why would I do this? Okay. Um, give, give me wire again. Yep. I mean, can you connect to there? Nope. Can you connect out here? There you go. I mean, that's hideous, but... Can I... Yo, dog. Let me in my own base. Okay. Um, okay, so is it th is this power actually going? There it goes, it opened at least. Okay, now let me in. Wait, what? Does this thing not have... The sun went down. Now we don't have power, period. Whoa! Oh, that's my flashlight. I was like, who's <laughs> shining a spotlight on me? Oh, gosh. Jesus, am I drunk? Um, okay, so we have an outlet that's outside. I'm so confused how this works. Either way, we need battery. Okay, I got my 91 magnetized ferrite. We're gonna probably need, I don't know, maybe two batteries? One battery is pro- I, I, Honestly, I, I have no idea. I don't know how many batteries we're gonna need. We do need a ton of carbon, though. And I'm trying to remember if we can buy carbon. on the space station because that might be the route to go because this is going to take us a minute to farm up all of these freaking trees and then again we're already 133 what are these toothpaste plants we get gamma root okay i kind of actually want to build not a portable one i want a general one what is this? 
Stores and preserves matter left over from the destruction of a previous base. That's interesting. But no, I, I, want, a, I want a large refiner. Ooh, it's chromatic metal. Ooh, does it have to be a large one? Can, can I get a normal one? Can I get a non? Why does it have to be large? Three different substances. Oh, well that's fancy. It's not really what I need. I, my big thing is, can I just run power to the portable one? What? Oh, now it's going up. Why? I don't know. I don't know. I give up. I give up trying to figure out what's going on with my base here. Not what I want. Power? Nope. Switches? Nifty. Electrical? No. Um, damn it. No, I can't. I really wish I could just plug this thing in. There you go. 304 condensed carbon. And I need how many? Damn, that thing is burning. I need 100. So that's a plus. And then we'll actually delete this line and we'll just run them straight to the battery and then have the battery plug into there. Good ideas all around. What do you got? Oh, we got plenty. Yeah, 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 yeah. Cool. Let's go make it. Okay, we got our first battery here. Let's go ahead and plug that bad boy down. Fantastic. I need some more magnetized ferrite for another one, but I definitely do want another one. So let's just delete that line right there. And then I'm not sure if having these run to each other is a good idea. So we're just going to go like this. You can go there. And then you can go there. And then you can plug in right there. Now we just need it to be sun. I need it to be daytime. Let's see if any of this works. I guess while we're waiting, we can go collect some ferrite. How much fer- er, I have a ton of ferrite dust. What am I doing? I forgot about that. Go me. I bought that <laughs> back at the space station because I wanted to be lazy. Oh, point proven. It's gonna come in handy right now. Okay. So we got that. Quick transfer. Put it on the stack. And then give me... Give me the ferret dust. This thing's gonna run out of power pretty quickly. And there it goes. Okay, okay, that's fine. How much carbon do I have? Okay, now let's go ahead and throw the carbon in. Go. Huge. How much condensed carbon did I have? I got 170. And how many, how much, uh, I'm gonna build two, why not? So I need, oh, I might have enough now. Yeah. So let's take this out, let's stop that. Oh, damn it, seriously? Let's go put some stuff in my ship then. Let's take the ferrite dust, uh, thank you. Let's take the ex uh, that, whatever you wanna call it. And then let's go ahead and put in, where's that? Pure ferrite. Perfect. How much is this going to make? 193. More than enough. It's going to take 40 seconds to do it. Quiet, you. Hey, get off my lawn. Get. Get. Get out of here. I'm trying to plant some grass. Okay. dog what I don't understand what is going on with this thing I give it power and it shuts so I don't I don't get that I'm awfully confused by that okay whatever whatever 
I'm hoping someone's gonna let me know what that is. I'm not gonna worry about it anymore this episode. So let's go ahead and throw down. We got enough for two more batteries. We're gonna fill these, uh, yeah. We're gonna get these bad boys going is what we're gonna do. Oh, man, I don't have enough condensed carbon. Got it. Um, hold on. Take my carbon back. I don't trust you, Mr. Refiner. Plop it down. And now I think our base is kind of, kind of super proof. Super proof. Future proof. And then I'm going to delete this one. There. Okay, we got power all the way around. Okay, it's storing 27 KP. This one is storing a little bit. And this one is storing a little bit. Good. Good. Now what else are we building? What, what else can we build? I guess we should probably get the old... Uh... No, not you guys. Construction. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We want a construction terminal and a science terminal. Oh, we can get a science terminal right now. Let's put these inside. <laughs> That's probably a pretty decent idea to put, put these inside. Can I just put it up against the wall? Is that up against the wall or is that floating? I can't really tell. Um. Yeah, right there. There you go. Now I just need to get a I I need to get a dude here. Hey, he's here! What's up, entity? I passed my test! I'm free to explore, free to pursue my passion for structural analysis. Do you have data to operate on? Any observatory would would supply some. Think of all that might be done. Corvax appears to have no memory of our previous encounters. I do not know if they feel reconnected with the convergence, or if they simply do not recall what they should feel like. I should visit observatory for them and see if the structural analysis they claim to enjoy will prompt a memory. Sure. Cool. So we got him. Return of the scientist. You bring great honor to the Corvax Traveler. Show respect. Okay, now what else do you got? Okay, well that's that's of no use. Okay, so now we need to get the construction terminal, and I need pure, 25 pure ferrite, which that is... Actually, hold on, hold on. I can do that. I can make that... Damn, can I just type it? I'm just gonna let it go. Ooh. Got it! <laughs> Okay, okay, okay. Now let's get the old construction terminal going. You wanna go there? That seems like a good enough spot. Let's get all of our homies here in one place. Yo, what's up, dude? I should let the get get on with their business. Okay, that's cool, but... Now what are they doing? Shouldn't I? There's one more terminal, I thought. Construction, science. Maybe not. I think that we should probably leave the storage outside. Probably for the best. It's just got to have power. You know what? We're going to put it right here. Bam. And then let's go ahead and get a power. Storage container. How much can you hold? 20 slots, that's actually really not even that good. I guess let's put the signal booster in. I don't know, what I'm gonna, the wiring loom, the navigational data, I don't know what I'm gonna do with that. Sure, yes. Um, The Gek Relic, we can hold on to those a little bit. Okay, let's put the ferrite dust in there. Actually, no, let's hold on to the ferrite dust. I think I'm gonna build some more. We've got one room. I'd like another room. Structures. 
large. Should we, do, should we go square this time? Oh, damn, that's a lot of pure ferrite that I need. That's why. That is why I bought all that ferrite. Okay, I forgot about that. Or all the ferrite dust. There you go. How much does that make? 915? Go. Go nuts. Okay, dude. Like, your construction, dude, What are you doing anything for me? No. No, I'm not. Or no, he is not. How far away is that? Ooh, we might go do that for him real quick. That's here. Do I have any missions for... Um, construct a microprocessor for the Overseer. Oh, well then. Can I do that? Didn't I just get a microprocessor? I need a carbon nanotube. Well, give me that. And then give me the microprocessor. There we go. Yep. Here's your microprocessor. I uh, trust our new Corvax friend was helpful. They're merely the start of our merry band. Are you ready to take the next step? Yes, I am. Okay. You have the microprocessors? You've done well. Thanks. There it is. We got a weapons terminal. And we got what we need to build it. Because apparently I have Pugnium. We're going to have to find a new place to put the refiner, though. Now, imagine this, friend. A life form displeases you. You punish it, reward it, reshape it. In time, it would do anything you wanted. So, it is with the Sentinels and their attacks. No more. Now we shall train the trainers. The Overseer requires me to kill Sentinels and bring back the... I got that. Hold on, let's go to the mission. See what it's telling me to do. Yeah, return to him. There it goes. You have it? Yes. The Overseer, in something of a state of excitement, asked me for it. Okay. Okay, I got a reward. There's n there is another matter. I gave you the means to create a weapons terminal, did I not? Yet I see no Viking in attendance. Does my help mean so little? Hey, hey. What a jerk. Ooh, a thermal protection mod. That's handy. We'll put that there. Pick this up. And then we are going to put this terminal. No. Right there. Cool. Okay, so nothing. I bet I need a dude. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I got my ferrite. So let's go ahead and throw on another portion. No, I don't want aquatic. Large. Should we go square this time? There we go. Ooh, wait, 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 wait. Can we put it on top of it? Ah, oh, we can do double layered. Oh, the dream. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to put an actual big refiner in this room. Because we need one. Yeah, I did. I did make it. It's right there. Oh, I got to hire an armorer. Damn it. Okay. I guess we're going to the spaceship. While we're actually going to the spaceship, let's make a stop over here to... Where's... I... I... Hey, where'd, where'd his... Oh, okay. We, we literally have two pages of it now. Um, yeah, we'll go stop over at the observatory. Now, the tricky thing with these buildings is where in the hell's the door? There we go. Okay, we got Corvax Observatory. What do you got going on here, dude? Data siphon installed. Assessing. The observatory appears to have been calibrated for a single purpose to locate the interfaces of a being the Corvax called the Atlas. After many years, the inhabitant of this facility succeeded in their quest, disappearing without a trace. Let's get that data. No Atlas Pass. 
Is there, is there really nothing else in here? Ooh. We got navigation data. I guess nanites. Alright. Kind of a bummer. I got ammo now. Is that really all there was here? I guess so. I'm not a big fan of how far away the space station is, actually is for us. We are a hop, skip, and a jump away from it. <clears throat> Here we go. Starship Merchant. Let's see if we can get that economy. Um, ooh, for nanites? We got a ton of nanites. So we got hyperdrive module. Uh, uh, so pulse engine. This module is flexible. Um, okay, it doesn't really tell me what it does, though. Positron, a supremely powerful upgrade for the positron ejector. Hmm, I don't know what that means. So, an extremely powerful upgrade for the infra knife accelerator. Oh, th these are expensive. Pulse engine? But what's it do? I'd wish to buy upgrades for my ship, bud, but I don't have any idea what any of those actually do. And then there's this guy. He's selling, he's selling, he's selling guns. Let's go over to the other, the other side of this place. There we go. So we got interface. We got lieutenant. Trade on what? What's your story, bud? I like your hat. Same, yep, same thing. So you're an overseer? Damn. I like the look of him. He's got a cooler hat than my guy does. Yada, yada, yada. You debate me in a place. Play only that the exocraft terminal is sufficient for my skills. Refusal. Refusal resulted in Neville extermination. Be quick. The tactician seeks work, claiming they'll be able to build and upgrade exocraft. Ooh, wait, why not? Why not? So I might need to go to another station. Because there's not an armorer here. Because I don't think. Unless I'm losing my mind. Okay, let's let's summon the old uh Let's go check over here. Let's see if I can find that economy scanner. Not sure where to get that, but like that ship that ship is a really cool okay I'll transmit milestone data what did I get oh damn I got a ton of nanites yeah what do you got so that's the same stuff <laughs> it's the same exact stuff I think we got bolt caster uh, underwater protection exocraft boost module blaze javelin Plasma Launcher, Minotaur Engine. I don't know what any of these things are. Okay, we got Starship Research. Um, okay, okay. Oh, there it is. Economy Scanner. Fantastic. Um, and then we have Conflict Scanner. This is what we're looking for. A Merrill Drive. Huh. Emergency warp unit? Okay, I'll grab the uh, economy scanner. Cool beans. So I can do that for sure. And I'll put that on my spaceship. 
So I need one wiring loom and I need five microprocessors. I'm probably gonna buy these and we have a wiring, uh, wiring loom back at the base. Cool, so we got that. Thanks for pointing that, that out that it uh, is very helpful. Other than that, we probably should get to going. We gotta find an armor somewhere. But I think what we'll do is go buy those microprocessors. Oh, my ship's over there. I don't know why that one has a little icon on it. We'll go buy those and then we'll install the economy scanner. And then that way kind of sets up next episode that we can maybe potentially go look around for a better economy system to hopefully find an armor and maybe a nicer ship. Who knows? I don't know what the economy for ships are though. I imagine that I can't get a nice one. I might be able to get something a little bit better than my puddle jumper though, which is kind of exciting. I do have the other two to trade in though, which I have no idea how much those are worth. Probably a little to nothing. Honestly, we don't even really have to go back to my base. We can, uh, we can just buy the, the wiring loom as well. And then that'll, that'll set us up real nicely. Okay, buy, I need, yes, one wiring loom. That is out freaking rageous. And then give me five microprocessors. Big money. Okay. Where we drop below the seven figure mark again. Okay, tech. Go ahead. Pop it in. Pop it in. Good to go. Huge. It's been a pretty productive day. I mean, we got our base and place uh, some things that it needed. Uh, we got our people moved over to this base finally to the terminals. We're on the lookout for an armor, and we got the economy scanner for our spaceship. So, you know, you can't you can't complain too much. So thanks for tuning in. Hit that thumbs up button if you enjoyed it. Hit that subscribe button if you want to see what happens next on my No Man's Sky Let's Play. I hope everyone has a fantastic day. I'll see you all in the next one. Take you later.